Team Reeves. What's up, family? Y'all saw the title. Let's get straight to it. In this video, we are talking about smart money versus dumb money. Smart money versus dumb money is a term that I came up with while I was in college at Louisiana Tech. How about them dogs? Being a business major, this was pretty much my area. I use this term the absolute most with a guy named Kirkland McCulloch. Kirk, that's my boy for life. But man, he was notorious for mismanaging his money. He was the definition of dumb money to say the least. And I ain't gonna cap my boy name, man. He'll tell you himself. In the most basic sense, smart money is when you spend your money wisely or you save money where you can. Dumb money is when you spend your money on stupid things or things that are unnecessary. Unnecessary meaning is going to put you in a worse position than you're currently in. There are better options to choose from or you just flat out don't need it. I don't need it. I definitely don't need it. How you manage your finances is really important. It can either make you or break you. This is something I believe that should be taught in grade school, but we're not going to get into that. So how do you know when you're managing your money well? It's not very hard to figure out. Are you constantly broke? There's a difference between being broke and being broke all the time. Are you living within your means? Or are you out here trying to impress people who probably don't even care to begin with? Here's the most important question. When you don't have money when you need it, is it your own fault? That's the question that needs to be answered. Understand, this does not apply to every single situation because everybody has different circumstances. But if you have money or an income and you have a habit of spending it irresponsibly, I'm talking to you. Here's an example of smart money versus dumb money. Buying groceries versus eating out. It's a very straightforward example. Let's say you go out to a restaurant and you spend what? Eight bucks on the appetizer, 10 bucks on the entree, and five bucks on drinks. With tax and a tip, that's 30 bucks easily. And if you're in a relationship, <laughs> you might as well triple that. Literally that same money you just spent on one meal you can take that to the grocery store and make at least three meals with it. Unless you're buying something crazy like imported steaks, but at that point, you just want to spend money. Don't get me wrong. Eating out is not bad. Going to restaurants is not a sin. But if you're doing it for every meal, every day, and it's one of your biggest expenses every month, cut that out. If you're going to Target and you're paying double for the exact same thing you can get at Dollar Tree, stop it. Stop it. Get some help. That's dumb money. But Reese, going to Dollar Tree makes me look poor. Bruh, if you're spending money unnecessarily, you was already gonna be poor. Goofy. <laughs> Stop spending money on stuff you don't need. You got a million pairs of shoes in your closet that you don't even wear. Why you need a new pair of heels? You got Netflix, Hulu, HBO Max, Showtime, BT Plus, Disney Plus, ESPN Plus, Plus Plus, and cable? Why? 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 Bro, you are wildin'. It's not even enough hours in a day to watch all of that. What are you doing? That's dumb money. But if you buying groceries, you use other people's Netflix and Hulu accounts, you learning how to cut your own hair instead of going to a barber shop and paying $100 for a lineup, you clicking two day shipping instead of paying 50 extra bucks for overnight shipping when you don't need to. That's smart money. Explore your options and choose well. Other than that chat, that's all I got for y'all. I'm out. Family, if you found this video valuable and you want more content like this, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that share button. Hey, just find a button and hit it. Or I'm gonna hit you. Nah, I wouldn't do that to you though. But I love y'all, man. Y'all gonna have a blessed day. Tell somebody you love them. Go drink some water. Say a quick little prayer. Go be great. Easy. Team Reeves.